This is Keon White, Georgia Tech, defensive line. Great story. All right, so you go to Old Dominion first. You're a tight end. You look like a tight end. <laughs> How long were you a tight end? So I was a tight end for my first two years. So started as a redshirt freshman. And then after that, my coaches were like, yeah, I know you're doing really well at tight end, but we're going to switch you to defense. All right, so they're telling you this. Everybody wants the ball, right? Everybody wants to be George Kittle or, or you know, whoever in the NFL, and now they're telling you're going to go to defense. What do you think about that? Um, it was fine for me. I kind of sort of like defense anyway. When I was getting recruited out of high school, I played both. I was getting recruited for both. And so when I made the switch to defense, it wasn't like a big fight for me. It was the coaches told me that we're going to try you out a spring ball, and if you suck at it, we're just going to put you back <laughs> to tight end anyway. So, And so then you end up at Georgia Tech. Mm -hmm. yeah. And in 2022, it all happened. Yeah. Why did it all happen for you this past season? Um, I feel like it's just the same recipe that everybody does. Like nobody knows, like nobody, it's not a secret. Uh, hard work, just hard work and just sticking to the process. And that's kind of sort of what I pride myself on. I'm not always going to be the best at something, but I'll try hard and work hard until I will be. 6'4", mm -hmm. 286. Yeah, so it weighed in here at 280 today, but I've kind of sort of been going through a body reconfiguration process. So leaving the season at Georgia Tech, I was probably about 22, 23% body fat at 287. And then now I'm 280 at 15% body fat. So definitely going through a body reco a recomposition phase Okay, right so now. where do you play on the defensive line in the NFL? The defensive line. You so, play everywhere. Yeah. And that's what everybody talks about yeah, with you. For sure. Definitely. And I like to be versatile. I like to be able to play all the positions and everything like that, for sure. And the fact that you could move inside and still be able to rush the passer, NFL teams are looking for guys like you now. Yeah, yeah definitely. So being versatile does nothing but help you. So I don't see it as, man, they keep moving me around. They keep. I like that. I like being able to be recognized as, hey, he can do this. He's not just a one-dimensional guy. So from Old Dominion at tight end to Georgia Tech, as a defensive lineman with seven and a half sacks and 57 tackles and 11 and a half tackles for loss. I mean, this has been a process, which I'm guessing means you're probably enjoying all of this as the process continues. Yeah, definitely. So I kind of sort of have a different perspective than most guys, because when I was at Georgia Tech, they do a good job of setting you up for life. And so I was working in corporate America. I was working at a company named McKinney's and another company called Certified Finishes. And I was working in the office. So. I realized then that office life isn't for me, and so I have a new appreciation for football. Like, not to say I didn't love football before, but it kind of makes you say, man, I like I could be working in a cubicle right now, but I get to do the interviews. I get to be in the senior bowl. I get to go to the combine, things like that. So this is a better job. Is yeah, you're for saying? sure. We'll do it as long as you can, trust yeah, me. It pays yeah. well, too. Yeah, for sure. Keon White, Georgia Tech, with us at the 2023 Reese's Senior Bowl.